revenue, but his outreach into the community. I hate to say that we've lost our way over the years from the time of, uh, if anyone recalls the name of the Zarek's, Dick and Florence Zarek, and, uh, and, uh, uh, and their outreach into the community. They had created a great, great um, outreach into the community. They put St. Nicholas on the map, and, um, and we kind of, once on their passing, we kind of lost our way. Well, those years in between, if it wasn't for Larry coming along and going back out into the community, and I'm not just talking about our community, which is the Arab American community, because this home was founded by Arab Americans, um, but it was founded for the community, for the Bay Ridge community, and the community at large. But if it wasn't for Larry going out beyond the, the borders of the Arab American community and going into the mainstream, that was, you know, that was a brilliant undertaking on his part, so much so that today, the, the, the amount of notices and the amount of contributions that are starting to come in are the seeds that both Larry and Philippa uh, uh, planted on behalf of the St. Nicholas home. I like to think that in the last couple of years, especially in the last couple of months, uh, Larry spent um, in, in earnest, Larry and Philippa uh, spent in earnest a uh, quest of, um, of really getting us planted, getting us moving along, and creating a fine legacy for everyone, and especially in his heart, creating a legacy for the senior citizens that live in our midst, and, the, and those that come, okay, any one of you who is 55 years and older is welcome to thank you, to have a habitat in the St. Nicholas home. It's a great place to be. Our administrator is here, Lori, she makes sure that everyone is, that we take care of everyone, and we feed them, and we, we, we keep them entertained, which is very important, because we don't want anybody. <laughs>